Now, a dense layer of smog has engulfed Delhi and the surrounding regions of Noida, Ghaziabad, Gurgaon and Faridabad on Wednesday morning, which has resulted in various flight diversions. Meanwhile, the air quality in New Delhi continues to be in the very poor category for the 15th consecutive day. And officials have said that it is likely to stay at the same level for the next six days. Now, the Indian Meteorological Department has said that zero-meter visibility was recorded at the Indira Gandhi International Airport at 8.30 a.m., with the runway visual range varying between 125 to 500 meters at different locations. Now, experts have warned that the conditions might actually worsen in the coming days. The difference between smoker and non-smoker is gone. 50-50 is the current distribution. So a so-called smoker and a so-called non-smoker, according to my data, and it is also corroborated by other cancer centers, it's an equal distribution, which is a very, very alarming change in a short span of 30 years that I've seen, and I attribute it to air pollution. The Delhi International Airport said in a post on social media platform X, while landing and takeoffs continue at the Delhi airport, flights that are not Category 3 compliant may get affected. Now, Category 3 is a navigation system that enables aircraft to land even when visibility is low. Now, due to the adverse weather conditions, about 10 flights were diverted, including 6 to Jaipur and 1 to Lucknow since 7 a.m. local time. Now, Delhi's overall 24-hour average air quality index was recorded at 361 at 8 a.m. local time. Meteorological conditions are likely to be extremely unfavorable for the dispersion of the pollutants. A senior meteorologist said that the fog and the smog during the day may reduce daytime temperatures. But let's in fact answer a pretty persistent question. What causes air pollution in the national capital in India? Now, traffic caused from vehicle influx intensifies pollution, particularly the nitrogen oxides, which account for nearly about 81% of the nitrogen oxides pollution in Delhi. And according to data that was presented by the CSE, local pollution sources in Delhi account for about 30.34% of the city's air pollution, 50.1% of which is contributed through transportation, while 34.97% originates from the neighbouring NCR districts, and 27.94% from other areas. The stubble burning contributes only about 8.19% to Delhi's pollution levels. Congestion-related emissions worsen the air quality, especially during the winter season, when inversion layers trap the pollutants close to the ground. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.